what's going on YouTube, Jake Cameo here, and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to open up some Fusion Strike. So we do have an Elite Trainer Box here, and you guys can see what all comes in it. Lots and lots of stuff. Um, the thing I'm most excited about is definitely the sleeves. So even if we don't pull anything, um, what was it, a Mew coin too? Oh, it was new, it's Mew Dice. Oh, bro. So sick. Um, I love dice, so that's super epic. Um, definitely excited about the sleeves though, and uh, even the booklet. Um, th I think it looks like uh, there might be a little booklet that comes in it. That's cool too. Um, but yeah, um, so Mew is my favorite Pokemon, so I've definitely been super duper excited for this set. And without further ado, uh, let's just go ahead and jump on into this. Alright, and hopefully you guys enjoy that background a little bit more than the OBS. Um, it's just a computer screen, but I just opened up um, Pokemon Showdown so that you guys can just enjoy the Professor Cameo picture for a little bit uh, rather than just viewing OBS. Um, let's see. Oh my gosh, that's so sick. So sick. Alright. So it comes with a little booklet that uh, shows you um, all the cards in the set. Uh, we're not going to go through all of that. Let's see here. We're gonna, oh yeah, that's beautiful. I love the Mew box. Oh my gosh, that's going to be uh, in my Mew collection for sure. Um, little rule book. Throw that down there. Um, some snazzy little, uh, snazzy little cardboard there. Um, then we have the Mew sleeves, which are super sick. Super sick. Love that. Probably going to use those in this video. Uh, there's a code card for you guys. Ba bam, there you go. Then we have our pack of energies, which is always useful for building decks. Um, we have our card dividers, which comes with like double sides. So there's a cute, super cute Mew there. And ba bam, there's a cute, super cute Mew there. So double sided. There you go. Whatever your preference may be, little card dividers. Then we have our um, uh, poison and burn um, coins. And then we have, oh yes, the Mew Dice, which is what I'm most excited for. Uh, you see the Mew Tail there? Oh man, yeah. That's awesome. Let's see if I can get it to focus here. It focused for a split second, and then now it's not going to focus. It's basically a Mewtail, and it looks like the Gigantamax cloud is around it in the center, maybe? Super cool. Super hyped about all of that. And then we have our packs here. So we're going to pull those out. Um, we're going to look at the different artworks, because I'm a fan of the pack artworks as well. So we have our Gengar pack. Of course, the star of the set, Mew. Then we have Genesect, which is a cool fossil Pokemon. Gengar, Mew, Genesect, and oh, and the last one is, um, oh man, he's from the, the Sword and Shield games. He, he evolves from, uh, I think it's Yamper. I cannot remember his name for the life of me. It's like something to do with Bolt, I'm pretty sure. Um... Yeah, I can't remember his name for the life of me. But with that being said, we are going to save all the Mew packs for last because that's my favorite. My second favorite is the Genesect. And so it looks like we're going to open the first pack is going to be the one that I can't remember. And then Gengar. Alright, so let's go ahead and open these packs here. I should just start from the bottom. Oh, or not. Okay. If I weren't so worried, I would probably just use scissors. Um, which could be the smarter play when they're as tough as this. Oh my goodness, yeah, this is super tough. Like, I got it open and it's, you hear that? I got it open and it's still like super tough to open. All right. So, and I think I've only opened like one or two of these packs before, so I really don't know what's in these packs either. Um, 
I say that when I just recorded the last video and I didn't know what was in the packs. Um, so, with that being said, let's go on through this. Oh, that's cool. Power tablet. Okay. Very cool. Will it focus at all? It's probably not going to focus because of the super bright screen behind us. Let's see if I can get it to focus if I just put my hand up here like this. Uh, that might that screen behind us might be fiddling with our stuff. So let me see here. There we go. And it looks a little better. That looks a little bit more focused. All right. And then we have Galarian Darmanitan. Phalanx, which is a cool mon. I really like this mon. I wish uh, I kind of wish they would do some kind of evolution for him in the next gen. That'd be super sick. Uh, Wooloo, Gossifleur. <gasps> oh, look at the cute Mudkip. Oh, he's so cute. Oh my goodness, what is going on here in this light show with Shelmet? Whoa. Uh, oh my goodness, this artwork is so cute. Plusle. I'm sure the mining artwork is just as cute. We have a reverse hollow Zoroark. And then we have a Galarian Corsola. It's a good thing we opened that pack first because that pack was kind of a dud. All right, moving on to the Gengar pack. Oh my goodness. Yo, these packs are nuts. What is going on? Like, I know I'm not that weak. Like, children cannot open these packs. There's no way. All right. So I'm back, and I got the big boys. All right. So I'm terribly, terribly afraid to do this, but I did it towards the very top there. All right. Now we have no trouble opening these bad boys. And there you go. Code card. One, two, three, four. All right, so we've got an energy, a Victini, an Electrike, a Dunsparce, a Krogunk, which is a mod I really, really like. I love Krogunk. A Panseer, a Gumi, Aerokuda, Schnabel. Ooh, a reverse rare Pangoro. So two dark type reverse rares back to back. And that artwork's kind of sick too. It looks pretty anime. It's dope. Ooh, and then in the Gengar pack, we get a Gengar V. Yo. Look at that Shadow Ball. That's awesome. Pain Explosion. Whoa. That's a cool card. All right, and that's technically our full first pull in our second pack. So that's not bad at all. All right, moving on. Make sure all the cards are down low, which is not recommended, but being very gentle with it when I do that. And very carefully opening the top because these packs are very rude and don't want to open. So I have to do this thing that I've never done before and I'm so scared to do. All right. Oh, every time. Bo bam. There you go. And one, two, three, four. All right. Spoiled something for myself. But these Gengar packs look to be fire. So, Diggersby. Ooh, Sydney. No wonder we're getting dark type reverses. Cross Switcher. Pancham, also looking very anime, looking off into the sunset. Galarian Darman or Darumaka, sorry, not Dar Darmantan. Indeedy. Oh, look at the Growlithe, being such a good boy. Another Phalanx. So is there two Phalanx artworks? Is that what that was? 
Let's see if I can find the other one. There are, there are two different phalanx. Interesting, interesting. I definitely like this one's artwork more. But that's crazy. Alright, move all these cards back to where they were. Alright. We got a reverse hollow wooloo. Let's see if it'll focus a little bit better. Hello. This camera doesn't like to focus very often, which is why I mainly use it on cards, which I probably shouldn't. Um, okay, it's just a wooloo. And then we have... Oh my goodness! Yo, is that is that some sort of alternate art? What is that? It's full art, for sure. It's Genesect and he's breakdancing with a Smeargle in the background. Yo, that has to be alternate art. Yo! I need to look at this set because I need to know how much this guy is because that is sick. I love Genesect and that is awesome. Yo! He's literally breakdancing. Like there's soda cans. Oh man, that's so cool. See here. I don't know if it, I honestly wasn't even paying attention to if it uh, focused or not. But hopefully you guys were able to see this pretty well. Unfortunately, it looks like about as good as it's going to get. It will not focus any more than that for some reason. I've sat here for probably five minutes trying to get this thing to focus for you guys. Unfortunately, that's that's what it's going to be. All right, moving on. Oh, goodness, I forgot about the scissors. Okay, here we go. Code card for you. Well, bam, there you go. One, two, three, four. All right. Water energy, cook. More grim. A quick ball. Oh, I love this artwork for the quick ball. Set that aside because I actually need that for my fossil deck that I'm building. Gossifleur, Mudkip with the cutie, cutie, cutie. Sandshrew, I love Sandshrew. A little claymation Sandshrew. A Kufant or a Cuffant. Not sure how you say that one. Uh, Impidimp. And he's scaring a substitute doll. He's practicing his scares. Ooh, a reverse hollow Melton. Interesting. And then we have a regular rare Zoro. Womp womp womp. Alright. Moving on to the last Genesect pack. Yo, I think actually... Did we get Genesect in a Genesect pack? No, I don't think we did. I think we got him out of a Gengar pack. I think the Gengar packs are just goaded. Alright. Womp womp. And code card for you. Well, bam. One, two, three, four. A fire energy. A dancer. A pangoro. A grap locked. A Geodude. I hate how fuzzy the, the picture is. I'm sorry, guys. Sizzlipede. Klefki. Pensage. A Wulu. There it goes. It's starting to focus a little bit. A Reverse Hollow Zarude. Yo, shout outs to that movie. That movie was actually pretty decent. And then a regular rare Azumarill. Womp womp. It looks like the Genesect packs were, were not goaded in the least. All right, and then we're moving on to my boy, Mew, my all-time favorite Pokemon. Getting some of his packs in here now. Oh, 
these are packed pretty tightly. There we go. All right, and code card for you. One, two, three, four. Ooh, these these feel a little light. Why, why do these feel light? Like they're like made out of like thinner cardboard. Hmm. Okay, so electric energy. Simi Sage. Dancer. A Halucha. A Muna. A Meowth. Oh my goodness, that is such cute artwork of Meryl. I wish it was not fuzzy. Because that is super cute. Super cute. Super cute artwork. Uh, Helioptile. Another Wooloo. They definitely put a lot of Wooloos in these. A Reverse Hollow Cloister. And then a hollow for alligator. Yo, I'll take that. I love me some for alligator, dude. Heck yeah. It's a rowdy for alligator. Alright. Last couple packs here. Getting pretty comfortable with these scissors. Probably shouldn't be, but. Well, bam! There you go. One, two, three, four. We got Steel Energy. Judge. Yo, his artwork's pretty sick too, for real. An Excadrill. A Persian. A Plusel with pretty sick artwork. Muna, Meowth, oh my goodness, I just realized that, that continues some artwork in previous sets with the Smeargle. Oh wow, just realized that, that's crazy. And there's that cute Meryl, finally getting it to focus now, Helioptile. Reverse Hollow Stantler. And regular Rare Scent of Scorch. Alright, come on, Mew. Come on, buddy. Last pack. You got this. You got this, Mew. You know, I would cry if I cut something good. You guys would see me cry on camera. Alright, last pack. Here's the code card for you guys. Ba bam And then one, two, three, four. Alright. Got Fighting Energy. A Graveler. Please focus on the last pack. Come on. Okay. That's fine. Don't do it. Musharna, Heatmore, Galarian Meowth, Gossifleur, Panpour, and Eevee. Alright. And we got a Shinx. Super cute. Oh my goodness, that is the cutest Bonobi artwork I've seen. Oh my gosh, that is adorable. Thank you for focusing on that. And then we have... Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. You know, last pack, it's a hollow. It's a Starmie, which is one of my favorite Water-type Pokemon. That is a very long description of a move that I'm not going to read. But you're welcome to. Uh, but yeah, so let's go ahead and cut for a recap. Alright, so I figured out if I put my thumb in front of the card, you can kind of see the picture better because it focuses better. So... Alright, so what we got here is our Starmie that we just pulled. Then we've got Feraligator. Super cool. Those are the two hollows that we got. And then we're moving on to Gengar V. Looking super sick. And then the best card we pulled. I'm almost positive it has to be Alternate Art. Look at that focus there. 
Genesect, break dancing, looking super happy, super sick, super awesome. And that's going to do it for this video. So thank you guys so much. If you guys enjoyed this, definitely let me know down below. Uh, if that's not our alternate artwork, then let me know down below as well. I'm sure I'll look it up after the video, but I always love uh, seeing you guys comment down below. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. And remember to love from your core. Peace out.